Christmas is right around the corner, and that means many people celebrating are getting their trees to decorate. News 12 Nightside's Emily Lorsch met up with one of the founders of Christmas Tree Brooklyn and tells us why so many Brooklynites are excited to support this local business while getting psyched for the holidays. Hey, how you doing? Hey, how's it going? Happy holidays. Happy Merry holidays. Christmas. Come in. If your tree isn't perfect, they can throw everything off. That's why in 2012, Brooklynite Dan Seventy and his sister Morgan started Christmas Tree Brooklyn to make sure everyone has the chance to get a tree that's just right. This is my Christmas business outfit. I call it Christmas casual. Dan letting me tag along as he delivered some trees in Park Slope. They deliver for free and offer a perfect tree guarantee. If you don't love your tree for any reason at all, we will bring you a replacement for free, no questions asked. Although it doesn't seem like he'll have to do that today, Greg Reed already getting ready to decorate his new tree, his first in 15 years. I always think about getting a tree, but it never really happens. I'm really excited. I feel like a little kid right now, actually. And it seems it wasn't just the tree he loved. Do you have something with it? Yes, they yeah. do. Perfect, perfect. I'll take the time too. It's great to be able to go to a store that's based here with people who are based here, who, who are from here, and that are supporting the community. So that's pretty dope. They also deliver donations and proceeds to Covenant House, an agency that provides housing and supportive services to youth facing homelessness in the city. If you know that your money is going somewhere else and still helping people, even after the holidays, that's kind of awesome. I might not throw this away, ever. <laughs> now Christmas Tree Brooklyn will be delivering trees up until January 15th, and then when you're done with your tree, they'll come get it from you and bring it to be recycled. In Williamsburg, Emily Lorsch, News 12 Brooklyn.